Ja, Daniel, uh, congratulations by winning the Remco Heid chess tournament. Um, first of all, uh, your prize, you, you won a horse. Uh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> This was a really interesting tournament because of the horse, so everyone know about the tournament. Uh, yeah, I won a horse and uh, as a good tradition, I spent it for the charity. Wow, it's a good thing. Yeah, um, Yeah, the, the, the tournament was decided in a blitz playoff because yeah. uh, it was exciting last round, yeah? Yes, very unexpected because I personally saw that look Playing with white and needed to draw for taking the clear first place will manage it. But uh, Sipke played quite sharp on orthodox and was able to win. And somehow I got a little bit lucky to win against Luke McShane in the last round. And so we get the situation when three players tied for the first place, beating each other in the, in the personal encounter which meant that we have to play blitz tie breaks. Yeah, did, did you um, expect that you could uh, get a shirt first after your very first round when you lost your game? Okay, after first round I don't know, but uh, actually, uh, yeah, I thought there are still some chances because the field is quite, t quite tight, it means that everyone can beat everyone. But before the last round I thought there were really small chances because, you know, one point ahead and white pieces and uh, quite comfortable advantage. But uh, it showed one more time that really tight field and uh, everyone can ha everything can happen, you know, the second game of the day, everyone is tired, so... Yeah, okay, now we have this blitz playoff. Uh, the very first game uh, was one between Sipke Ernst and... Uh, yes. Was it difficult for you to, to watch the game and not play? I wasn't actually really watching and uh, I just saw that I think uh, Luke blundered the rook at the end or something or he sought for some tactic and I was just waiting for my game yeah. and uh, Do you feel, did you feel confident at that point? Uh, I wasn't thinking about if I would win or not at just two blitz games I thought okay it's another two games let's play um, I like to play blitz and uh, went quite well. Okay, in the first game against uh, Ernst, uh, I got very good position out of the opening, I was in completely winning, and then some moment I started uh, to play not so exactly, and uh, no, he played, uh, he had like less than 10 seconds, seconds all the time, and then some moment I look at uh, watching uh, my clocks and I say, okay. I have only 30 seconds and my position will not improve, but then I found some tactics and uh, I managed to win somehow. And yeah. Well, although you live in Germany, you do play a lot of uh, Blitz and Rapid tournaments here in the Netherlands. Yes. Do you think it will help? This, this helps your... Uh, uh, did you exercise a lot? Uh, uh, difficult to say. You mean uh, exercise during the tournaments? or was yeah, yeah, did you practice? Yeah. Yeah, I, I mean that practice is quite important. Okay, you have to work at home, of course, but without playing, it's really difficult to to improve your chess. I'm not sure how much how 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 much you should play. This is the, the, the big question, of course. But I just like to play some rapid chess, and here in Holland, it's many nice tournaments. I played many times, so keep coming. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And uh, well, uh, now your feeder rating is about 26. 26, 68 at the 68 moment. 68 at the moment, yeah. yeah. Do you think, do, do you have ambitions to, to get to 2700? Um, okay, somehow I have ambition to have, I think I have a possibility to get to 2700, and then I actually know what I have to do, so some things that I need to improve, and I have to fight. Uh, my laziness of course um, but it's not not a big target for me you know because okay nowadays 2700 it's still a mark but it's already 50 players in the world 2700 since okay it's special but it's not so special as it was like few years ago man okay and um it's the very first time you played here in Wolfgang? Um how did you like the, the tournament? Because we have the, the open tournament as well. And, uh, 
uh, I liked the tournament uh, very much and uh, it was nice organized and uh, good field, good conditions. It's really bit, little bit tough to play two games a day, of course, and uh, a bit unusual in the, pa in the past time that uh, to play without an increment. You know, I cannot remember the last time I played without an increment the classical game. As on the other hand, it's not counted for FIDE, so it's a little bit more relaxing and friendly atmosphere here. And also an open tournament. I was considering to play an open tournament as well. I mean, not as well, if I wouldn't be invited or something. Okay, well, um, thank you very much. And we look forward to, to see you again uh, in the next edition of the tournament. Yeah, thank you very much. See you in two years. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, Thanks. thank you.